Good morning everyone, welcome back to our channel. Uh, week one of school holidays and we are out and about. So today we are at Dream City, which is a brand new high-tech city where children are inspired to learn through fun career activities. So this uh, center is located in um, Docklands within the DFO South Wolf building. It's on level one, just above uh, Adidas. So Dream City is Melbourne's latest entertainment center. So they only opened recently and basically what they have here, they cater for kids between the age of five to 12. And in here, they look at a combination of science, technology, engineering, arts, um, and also maths, and they, they, they collide all of them together to a big explosion of fun. So basically what they have here is they have got pods around, and each pod is uh, dedicated to a particular activity. So for example, there's a fire station pod where kids would learn um, how to put off fires and what firefighters do, and there is also a flight uh, pod where you know, kids will learn about uh, how how flights take off, and you know they also have a chance at a flight stimulation. We we'll had podcast session where kids can learn how podcasts are done and give it also a go to actually do a podcast. They have got VR session, virtual reality, where they can put on their virtual reality goggles and also have a bit of fun there. They have also got a science lab where they can learn a bit of science. They can also practice to become surgeons where they do keyhole surgeries. And they've also got uh, a section where they can also practice to become nurses, uh, neonatal nurses as well. So there's a heap of fun here. So this is, a, uh, and the activities are catered by age as well. So Mehran and Mahavir are, are, nine, are turning nine on, on, on Monday. And so uh, they, they fall within the eight and 10 year old activity group. And within that, there's, there's uh, about 12 activities that they can do today. So they open between 10.30 to about 4.30 and they say that within that, that, that period uh, kids should be able to uh, cover all the activities. So each activity runs for about 25 minutes and they've got a 5 minute uh, swap over time for them to sort of move to the next activity and they've got a timetable there as well which you can see up in the description. I've also put a timetable there and in which um, they can sort of pick and choose how they want their day to go and pick the activities that they want, which is really great. So basically kids have got the opportunity to figure out and work out what they want to learn first and how they want to, their day to go. So stay tuned and we will uh, show you a quick preview of the area. And uh, also the good news is we've got the general manager here with us today. And the general manager is a great to give us a quick tour as well. So stay tuned for that. Cheers. So here we are, a preview of the Dream City. So what we have here is hospital and that's the neonatal section. We've got robotics and the science lab up there. Here we've got Rubik Cubes challenges. And on this side here, we've got electronics, where kids learn a bit about electronics. We've got to put on all their gowns and stuff. And then on this side here, we've got the fire station. Lots and lots of people. We are booked out today. And here we have got the podcast section and also video editing where they learn how to do podcasts. This side we have got the flight center where in here we have got a basically something that looks like an aeroplane and in there they teach their kids about how flights take off and also get a go at one of the stimulators you can see that pretty cool and here they get to play a bit of spot we've got 
basketball. And this is the fun part. Virtual reality. Check that out. Virtual reality. There, Meherwan and Mahabir are sitting there, listening to instructions. And as you walk through, there is also a nice cafe where you could get coffee. And you can also book the place if you want to have a party. Thank you, Michelle, for allowing us to do the video today and also for joining us here. Um, yeah, can you just give us a quick spill of, uh, of this place and, and, and you know what it's all about and the facilities, your opening hours and also your expansion plans moving forward? Sure. So Dream City is a high-tech city that we've built just for kids, okay? It is high-tech, high-fun, the latest and greatest, you name it, we've got it. It is uh, all underpinned uh, by the principles of STEM, which is a part of the Victorian and the Australian curriculum. So STEM, or STEAM as it is also known, is science, technology, engineering, arts and mathematics, okay? Um, and we have 10 activity pods, which are all featuring those curriculum areas um, and which of course are also career focus points okay so for example we have our aeroplane okay kids go in there they learn about the physics of flight okay they learn terminology the proper terminology lift thrust drag um, they go into the fire station, they're learning about the chemistry of fire, they're learning in the electrical engineering pod, they're learning about how circuits work, why circuits need to be a complete circle to work. They go into the surgery, they're learning how to perform a laparoscopy, okay, they're learning and they're using the, all the actual technology that doctors who are undertaking their surgical training are using, okay, so nothing here that we use is fake. We are using the latest and greatest technology that is available for our kids. We believe that kids learn by doing. There's nothing like experiential hands-on learning um, to, for kids to take it into their brains. What we really want to do is go some way in helping kids understand that there's more to a career than what is up front for them, okay? So, for example, behind us here in the podcasting studio, or the TV studio, every child at some point in their life, they want to be an actor or they want to be on the radio or they want to be an AFL player or whatever. But those people are nothing without the the people behind the scenes. They're nothing without cam uh, camera people, wardrobe, sound, lighting, um, and all of those are legitimate careers. Not everyone has to be on the screen um, you know, to make it, okay? So we want to really help kids understand the depth and the breadth of careers, um, not so much groom them to be one of those, within one of those careers, but to show them what possibilities actually exist out in the world, you know? Um, because kids have a frame of reference that is only their frame. You know, and by coming to Dream City, we hope to also go some way in, in addressing the gender imbalance of particularly girls studying STEM or STEAM uh, subjects at school. So, there, you know, the research all says today that girls don't study science, tech, engineering, mathematical uh, based subjects. You know, they girls tend to study more of the arts and the creative type of subjects but they're actually really good at those science and tech and the mathematical subjects but so what we want to show the girls as well is that they can do it and they should do it and we need them to do it okay so that um, you know within their futures they've got something and, and they feel valued more than just, you know, there's nothing wrong with being creative, but if they want to be more, they can be. And if we go 
just by influencing one child to study science for one more year at school or you know if we influence one child to study uh, biology at a VCE level then we've done something you know that they might not have otherwise done you know I had a child in here two weeks ago who uh, said and her supervising adults almost fell over when she said I want to be a firefighter <laughs> you know because she didn't want you know she came in here not wanting to really do anything came out wanting to be a firefighter other kids girls they come in not knowing you know they gravitate towards being a neonatal nurse you know or the more girly sort of subjects but they love being a pilot and how fantastic is that so dream city is open uh, in the school holiday periods, Dream City is open Monday to Sunday from 10.30 a.m. until 4.30 p.m. We sell an all-day ticket, okay, which is $75, okay, but that is for 10 activities. So we remind everyone that that is $7.50 an activity or, you know, while you're here, you can work out the, the maths and that's $12 an hour. You can be here for that full six hours, okay. Um, and we like to think that you know the kids are learning something while they're here so that's bang for buck for a grown-up uh, we think you know that's that's um not just dead money you know you don't walk out of here going you know because the kids are coming away with an enduring learning you know they will have been in the tv studio today and learned about green screen effects and you'll be watching a movie in two weeks time or probably in two days time in the school holidays because you'll be pulling your hair out with things to do with them they'll tell you about superman or spider-man or something a green screen thing and you will have forgotten about dream city because we're adults and we have so many things going on and you wonder how they know that, but they know that because they've learned it here. Yes. So they carry that learning on then into other things that they do, okay? Um, so yeah, in the school holidays, we are open every single day. We do recommend booking in advance because we, we do sell out. We've had three sellout days in a row. Uh, and the second week of the school holidays look, looks to be not different. It looks to be sold out as well. Uh, during the school term, we are open Monday to Friday for school and large group bookings, okay? So recommend telling all your kids teachers and school groups about it getting them through for an excursion and then we're open on the weekends uh, Saturday and Sunday from 10 30 a.m. until 4 30 p.m. at that $75 price okay so we'd love to see you all come down and join us and um, yeah Thank you so tell much. us that you saw us on um, the YouTube channel I yeah. suppose yeah. thanks for coming down today guys Thank really you. appreciate it Thank you so much for that. You're welcome. So guys, uh, so that was Michelle with us and I think she gave given us a really good um, insights of, of this place and I think um, uh, it has got a lot of potential moving forward and it's sort of hitting the right uh, needs for kids these days as well. So um, the boys have had heaps of fun today. We got here at about 10.30 and we are, now it's about close to 5 o'clock and we are just uh, walking out. It's been great. We in that in the time that we are here, we managed to complete all the activities. We managed to have lunch as well, and the boys learned a lot, a lot, a lot. So, Nareen, what's your thoughts of the place? Yeah, it's a great place. Very educative, and the kids actually learn by playing. And uh, parents, we actually did not have anything much to do. We just have to help them, guide them on which uh, sports that they need to go according to the times and uh, yeah we could actually talk and spend time together the whole day and the kids are very well entertained and learn at the same time so i would suggest if uh, parents if you you want to come in a group like a group of moms or a group of couples together that would be great because you can actually spend time together and the kids will have their own thing to do exactly yeah. exactly, exactly. So yes, uh, I'll, I'll now switch over to the boys and see what they've got to say. So how, how did you find your day today? Did you enjoy? Did Just you learn I, a lot? Yep, I, I learned a lot. I even made my own electronic. It's good. The ice cream is amazing. Yeah. And Mommy, what about you? Did you learn a lot today? I learned a lot, but since I want to do again Dream City. You want to come again to Dream City? That's great. But this is what, what I want to do the most. The electronic. Okay, cool. So which was your most favorite activity, Mehran? 
Okay. Uh, I have three. Okay. So uh, the VR headset. Yep. The sports and last but not least, electronics. Electronics. What about you, Mavi? What was your favorite? I had two. Okay, we chose it. So the, my first day of exactly with my brothers. Yeah. My last one was making a TV show, and my my mom and 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 daddy had to watch them, and they got to watch us. Yeah, excellent. So yeah, guys. So that was it. Uh, thank you for watching this series, and uh, again. Please like, please subscribe for more videos and see you next time. See ya! Bye. So, Dream World is Melbourne's uh, latest editing. Uh, we are at Dream World.